Let's balance the chemical equation Al plus Cl2 yields AlCl3, aluminum plus chlorine gas. We'll also look at the type of reaction and write the states. So let's count the atoms up. One aluminum, two chlorines. Product side, one aluminum, three chlorines. It's probably best to get this number here to an even number. That should make it easy to balance. So if we put a coefficient of two in front of the AlCl3, two goes to everything. So one times two, that gives us two aluminums, three times two, that'll give us six chlorine atoms. To balance the chlorines, we could put a three here, two times three, that gives us six. And the aluminums, we need two of them, put a coefficient of two, one times two, that gives us two. And we're done. This equation is balanced. If we want to look at the type of reaction, we have two things. We have aluminum and then the chlorine here. They're coming together to form just this one substance. That makes this a combination reaction, also called a synthesis reaction. We could also call it a redox reaction. The aluminum and the chlorines, they're changing their oxidation states. If we wanted to write the states for this reaction, aluminum, that's going to be a solid. Chlorine, that's a gas. Cl2 is a gas. And then aluminum chloride, that would also be a solid. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for Al plus Cl2 yields AlCl3. Type of reaction is combination or synthesis. Thanks for watching.